What's up, everybody? RJ back from the review. Today I'm reviewing uh, Doom on uh, DVD. This is the unrated version, starring uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson, or The Rock for you wrestling fans, and for you non-wrestling fans, it's Dwayne Johnson, or maybe The Rock as well. But uh, this is uh, the DVD of Doom. All right, there's the back of it. Before we get into the story, I want to tell you guys a little bit. Uh, I've heard a lot about this from people, and people that are like hardcore fans of the uh, the video game Doom, which is which is supposed to be loosely based upon. Uh, a lot of people that either really like this or they really don't. The people that are like hardcore fans, usually some of them don't like it because it doesn't like hold true to a lot of the game aspects. And a lot of people that uh, that do like it are like me myself, which I did personally play the games, but I, I didn't go into this thing. It's going to be all just like the... The thing I just thought it was gonna be a nice, you know, cool, you know, sci-fi shooter, you know, and stuff, movie. But it was, it, I didn't get mad. I personally like this movie, and uh, just letting you guys know if you're like a hardcore Doom fan of the video game genre and stuff, you might not, you might not like this so much. But this is uh, Doom, like I said, the unrated version. The unrated version is supposed to be an uh, unrated extended edition movie that is too intense for theaters. So uh, I didn't see the theatrical version, so I don't know. What the difference is, but uh, this movie cons uh, is about a uh, a frantic call at the beginning gets this gets called out. Uh, they get called for help uh, to a, from a research facility uh, in Mars, and uh, they send out a team of mercenary Marines into action, and uh, they they pretty much get into this thing. And they discover that there's some crazy stuff going on, mutations. And stuff. You know, I mean, they've been studying something they shouldn't have been studying, and, and a lot of stuff goes on. And uh, pretty much, it's uh, it's up to them to you know to kill the virus and figure out what's going on and eliminate the problem. And a lot of a lot of things happen in this. I don't want to give it a lot away, but that's pretty much what it's about. Uh, there's a lot of graphic uh, blood and stuff. If you're a fan of Predator, it kind of reminded me of like a like a predator on on Mars, pretty much. Just reminded me of people who had no idea what was going on. Had big dudes with like crazy machine guns and uh, mini guns and stuff. And it, it was just reminded me a lot of like a space version of Predator. If you don't play uh, the games Doom and stuff, then just think if you like Predator, you'll probably like this. I, I personally like this. And uh, as far as special features goes, it's got a uh, first-person uh, shooter sequence. That uh, that you can play. It's like a little, like kind of like a basically like a little demo of Doom and stuff. But that's pretty much all on this. I can't think of anything else. But uh, if, like I said, if you like Doom, the game, you'll probably like this. That's pretty much all there is to it. I just figured I'd just throw it out there. Didn't know really what to say about it. Just anyone that's interested. There you go.